My name is Ron Drescher. I'm an attorney practicing bankruptcy and commercial litigation in Maryland, Delaware, Pennsylvania, and Virginia. And today I want to answer the question, I'm filling out my schedules and the forms are asking that if the claims against me are contingent, liquidated, or disputed. What does that mean? A claim is liquidated if it's a sum certain. That's the phrase we use in the law. If we can look at a promissory note and say, well, based upon all of the payments that have been made, the sums that are due under the note, the interest rate, the number of days since default, and those kind of things, we can identify the exact amount that is due. But if we can't exactly determine the amount that's due under that claim, that's called an unliquidated claim, and you have to go to court and bring evidence to determine the amount of your damages. Classic unliquidated claim is when if there's been an automobile accident or any other tort claim, you have to figure out what the damages are. The same thing is true in most breach of contract claims where the other side has defaulted and we have to figure out how the performing side has been damaged. Courts are going to take evidence to determine the amount of that claim and liquidate that claim. My name is Ron Drescher. I'm an attorney practicing bankruptcy and commercial litigation. If you have a question about whether or not your claims are liquidated, disputed, or contingent, please pick up the phone and call me. I would love to hear from you.